Hello everybody! Welcome to the start of a new single player season. You may be asking why I'm staring at multiplayer screen. Truth is, I am running it on a server just to handle chunk loading easier. And especially when I'm running thousands of mods. Okay, 68 mods actually. I can show you. 64 mods. Close enough. And I will be adding plenty more mods as well. So, just because of how many mods I'm loading, running it on a computer single player is a little bit excessive, so it's, I'm running the server on my computer, but just the way that chunk handling works, it's kind of weird. So I have generated this that I've been on just to make sure it looks cool. I uh, picked out a seed I liked that worked with mods. We do have plenty of mods, if you probably can see several of them, noting that the chickens were hats. We do have the hats mod, and I'm just going to go ahead and pick a random hat, I don't like that one. Uh, tower of 20 hat. Crown, that'll work. Alright, so it actually does add a crown to your head. You will see this in my server play series, which is actually running pretty much the same mod pack, except a little bit different. Materials in you, it's a handoff from Tinker's Construct. I'll be getting into that when I go through any eye. Let's make sure I'm out of cheat mode, so I'm not screwing around. I was making sure everything was working earlier, because I did have to set the whole thing up. Get block IDs set. So, let's see, we got lots of extra mods, um, yeah, I guess I'll be getting to that later. Um, yeah. So, unnamed, what on earth? Alright, this is all vanilla stuff, we got IC2, we have a beta of it, I believe. Ender Storage is definitely here. Red Rock, that's extra biomes, for those of you that did not know. Vanilla, vanilla, vanilla. Yeah, we have vanilla, that's the mod, first mod I put on. We do have Railcraft, is all of this. Lots and lots of Railcraft, more Railcraft, Compact Solars. Awesome. This is, um, shoot, it's gonna come to me. It'll, it'll come to me in a second. I, I forget what it is. Ooh. Okay. Oh, Railcraft adds these stairs, I forgot that they did that. That's awesome. LAN cable, I believe. I don't know what that is. Oh, that is from Amoebus. We do have his mods here. We got chicken chunks. I haven't tested if those works. Um, God, this mod's going to come to me in like 12 seconds. I have to pull up the name of it in a second. Um, So, yeah, that mod, it's magic-based. It's got cool magic spells and stuff I'll show you. We got forestry, uh, Steve's carts, there's computer craft, soldering station, logistics power junction, we have logistics pipes. Oh, look at all the micro blocks, but wait, red power isn't out yet. We have Amibus micro blocks, which are cooler, they've got more items I can make, TNT, and I can enable it so that mod items are shown up as well as so I can have like two-thirds of a nuclear reactor it's pretty cool but until then so yeah I don't know if glowstone stuff actually um glows I have to find that out so this is pretty cool lots and lots of it and then we get over to the stencil table and the pattern chest Ooh, this is from Tinker's Construct adds its own ores, and what you do is it's basically making its own metal, like using the metals, and then you can make thousands of different kinds of tools with special abilities, and it has ore bushes, it's pretty cool. We got build craft, that's the public version, I believe, yeah. And then, this is, filler. hmm, wow, that is the laser mod, I think, for universal electricity, it's definitely a laser mod. Yeah, lasers. Power ore, this is from uh, another one. I'm gonna pull up a mods list over here. I know, it's pathetic. Uh, it'll come to me in a second. Dart craft, that has the power stuff. And I'm gonna go ahead and get that magic one. I wanna see, it is Ars Magica. There we go, that's it. We do have Thermal Expansion. God, why can't I? Those are new mods I've never played with, so that's probably why. Thermal Expansion adds all of these. Thermal Expansion has added a lot of cool stuff, like the Glowstone Illuminator, and then blocks of ingots, rock wool, advanced crate. That is from Universal Electricity. 
I think that's... Which one is that? I want to say it's assembly line, but I don't remember if I have it in here. Um, I don't... Oh, I do have assembly line. Alright, that's assembly line. We have... Oh, God, is it already nighttime? Alright, well, I'm going to set it to daytime. Only time I'm going to be cheating. Time. Day. Because uh, we haven't actually started yet. It's a cool world. And then, so we got... Uh, God, Twilight Forest. Jeez, I'm horrible with names right now. Another more of extra biomes. We got Thalmcraft up here, definitely. Cool mod. Or charge pads. God. Um, yeah. Solar arrays. Those are not solar arrays. Those are windmills. That's so weird. Power armor. We do have power stuff. <laughs> I like the sky turns colors. Um. Aladu, that's, I th yeah, that must be, um, equivalent exchange three, it looks like it's going with that, only thing we can make so far is a minium stone, but we will get to that, more universal electricity crap, um, we do have Natura, which is a companion mod to Tinker's Construct, ME storage, we do have applied energistics, I don't know if I'll get around to that, but I might, this is... This stuff is called from Minecam. It's pretty awesome. I'll get to that later. Um, this should be. There's a, we do have MFFS. I thought that was it, but I guess not. Then yeah, so a bunch of ME crap. Here's all the Minecam cam goals you can make. Pretty crazy stuff. I know. Forestry. There's our. Here's some of the more dark craft stuff. Logistics pipes. Logistics pipes. Railcraft. There's MFFS stuff. So yeah. I think that's most of it. Here's all the blades and stuff you can add to Tinker's Construct. It's pretty awesome. We'll get to that soon. Got Backpacks mod, of course. I think that covers just about it. And obviously there's some other ones we have. From thermal, from the universal electricity, I got a little bit more. I should have portal gun and gravity gun and omni wrench. Thank goodness. Yeah, there's ours magica, magic stuff, thermal expansion, and we're almost there. Uh, did I see something? We do have animal bikes. Forgot about that. That's gonna be cool. And there's end stone right there. I can get an ender dragon bike really quickly. That's gonna be cool. Uh, and that's about it. I see two. Love it, John, again, that's pretty much it. So, those are the mods we have. I know it was a bit boring, but let's check out Spawn. Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, you see the clouds up there? Uh, there we go. Zoom. Clouds are from nature. This big tree is from nature as well. Alright, so, I don't know what time of day it is, because the sun's not even out. But yeah, um... I think I need to mark that as spawn, because I tried to do slash spawn earlier, and it, like, just put us in some random spot. Because the seed was messed up, so it's... Set spawn. Do not have access to... Okay, then. Great. Um, let's see. Barley is... I think we can use that instead of wheat. Ooh, lag. So, yeah. Um, first episode is always a bit boring. I know I'm not going to be able to build a whole lot this episode. I will get working with some stuff. Go mining. It seems that this world has a lot of ores. Like, more than it usually should. Which is kind of weird. What is this? That is a chicken in the ground? Alright, I hear zombies. Not good. <sighs> so yeah, end stone outside of the end is always interesting. This is from Ars Magica. Got some dungeons. I don't know if there's bad guys in here. I'm assuming there's going to be, but... I think we'll go explore it later. We've got Extreme Jungle. I probably will be building a house there. I like Extreme Jungle. One of my favorite biomes. We've got nice big plains to build in. Cool stuff. For now, I think we're going to dig into this tree. And get some more seeds. Why not? Come on, chicken. 
I need that. Thank. Oh, oh, because I got seeds. They're all coming toward me. That's awesome. Come on, tall grass. You're not helping me here. Oh, awesome. First cave. Right there. Wow, it sucks that it's raining right now. But yeah, for those of you that remember, I had one previous single player. I usually lean toward multiplayer just because I have people to talk to and people to hand tasks to. Be like, hey, you, go get me some wool or something. So, I usually do that, but... Single player is always cool because I got my own recording schedule and I need to start walking. Actually, I have to start walking now. Great. <sighs> Alrighty, plenty of water. So, let's just start digging in here. Cool thing is, I get wood and a first home. Because these trees are huge. Yeah, there actually are two different kinds of wood, if you notice. They've got redwood and redwood bark. It's pretty awesome. So, we got ourselves a huge... What are you doing? Alright, you want to be slaughtered? You can go ahead. Thank you very much. Yeah, I think it's interesting. The hats mod actually lets animals wear hats. Like, all of the animals have hats. It's cool. Alrighty, so. Um, hmm. Okay. Fair enough. I think we're just going to start hollowing this out. And then I can get some wood and make my first crafting table. Fun. And then I can go ahead to that cave up there. Redwood planks. Bam, crafting table. Awesome. So, just get some of those. And a pick. And then an axe. And that will speed up a lot of things. Yeah, I'm still getting over a cold. It's kind of weird. Like, the cold is just lingering that's really all it's doing right now so if you hear me mute my mic like I just did that's me coughing I don't want to cough at you guys because it's kind of loud so that's what's up with my voice if you haven't noticed which I hope you haven't noticed because that's good it means I'm doing something right all right so that looks like a bit of wood and a pathetically small house I need to find sheep There's no recipe for wool, is there? Wait, that's a sheep. Right there. Yes. Oh my god, thank goodness. Oh, you have no idea. There is a chicken wearing a pig on its head. And I hear a spider. So this ore hanging around, that is an ore bush. Wow. Really? That's pretty awesome. We've already got like this, a lot of caves around here. Okay, cool. This is a cool place. Look at this. I'm loving this seed. I didn't get a single piece of wood from that. For wool. Well, there we go. Yeah, man. Thank you, wool. Um, are there any berries on these bushes? There is. Awesome. So, blueberry. Crap. Come on. Pick up some stuff. There we go. This will heal a tiny bit and lag. Awesome. I can break these, and I think it will. And then they're gonna actually, like, grow from small bushes. So, that's really cool. I like how the bushes grow up. But I need one more sheepy. Come on, sheepy. Suppose I can use an axe on you. And there. Perfect. And then, is this really surface gold? Or, yeah, it's gold bush. It's, wow. That's awesome. So, yeah, you can see there's all kinds of ores on the surface, which I love about Natura. I think it, yeah, Natura is the one that adds that. It's awesome because you don't have to go caving first off the bat. Because it adds stuff. And then as you get lower, there's actually, like, bushes that grow underground. So, are you kidding me? Of all the places for zombies to spawn. Get out of here. I hope you die. Oh my god, my lag. They'll have to fix some of my settings. It's not actually that bad. Okay, yeah, I am gonna die. I'm just gonna be holding myself up in here.
Awesome. Um. All right, let's eat raw chicken. God, I'm gonna die from raw chicken. Get salmonella or something. There we go. Yep. Awesome. And why not? Oops. Alrighty, I've got a chicken. Did he just really just walk out? Awesome. Okay, the rain stopped. That's cool. I can make a bed. And then that should make awesome. Bed. Oh my god, get out of here. I can't sleep when you guys are around. It's getting dark, actually, isn't it? Come on. Alrighty. One more pair of sticks. I'm gonna need... And then one of you, and then one of you. Ah, why on earth am I lagging? Like, oh. Alrighty, guys, we will be right back. Alrighty, we're back. So I think I, I just tweaked my video settings a little bit, and we're back to less lag, I hope. I don't know what was up with that, but... Who cares? I am... Um, yeah, sorry if it's a little bit dark on camera. I know that's the way YouTube is. It just, like, darkens everything. Like, I, I think it actually does make things darker. But we can... Uh Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. Why don't I just make a sword? Alright, XP. Can I, can I sleep now? I have my bed spawn set. Alrighty, so, what, what on earth is out here? I'm gonna die, like, after two seconds in the game. Oh my god, is that it? I think that's it. Alrighty. Let's just, uh, place that down and sleep. There we go. Oh my god. Longest time to sleep forever. Okay, and it's morning. Do, 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 do. Oh my god, Enderman. Yeah. So it's kind of scary at nighttime with mods like this. But it's daytime. So, first order of business in the daylight is to. Oh my god. You have got to be kidding me. I didn't provoke him. It's okay. Alrighty. So, we'll just leave that Enderman there and get a door. Can I. Can I please make a door? I need more bark. Are you kidding me? Hmm. Well, alright. Maybe if I use the planks. Hang on. Door. Ah, oh, you need the bark. Dang it. Um. Alright, so a neat little secret here is that the bark actually goes to... Dude! Enderman! What are you doing? You're, you're defiling my house. Freaking serious. Yeah, you want to come? Come at me. I dare you. Come on. Thank you very much. That skeleton is not going to treat me well. I guarantee it. Alrighty, so let's move that out of here. And kill the skeleton at another time. Alright, so where are my bushes? They are right here. We can go ahead and place those right there. And they will start getting us food. No, no, no. Oh dear. There we go. Look at that parkour skills right there. Just one hit everything. Yeah. That's the only problem with living under a tree, is there's so many mob spawns. Enderman, awesome. There are squids wearing all kinds of hats. That freaked me out there for a second. Alright, so one, two, three, four, and a little bit for extra measure. Perfect. Yeah, I. that's actually really cool. Up the hills over there. 
this is I, I love this one so far. It's pretty awesome. I probably should not be sprinting. Is that a Enderman? No, that's a skeleton. Yeah, I'm gonna have to light this up pretty quickly. I don't know if there's surface coal though. Have yet to see that. So, hidden door. You ready for this? Believe it or not, it's hidden. Well, alright. It's kind of hidden. It's more hidden than a normal door. Alright, give it up. So, yeah. This is a beautiful place. Let's go ahead and make a... A bit more planks. So, I think I might live in here for a while. It's actually not that bad of a place. Considering you can go up a lot of floors. So, let's just stick a lot of this in. Let me keep that and that on me. Barley, I forgot. I can use this to make bread. There we go. Where do we grow in the wild? Alright, awesome. And then materials and book. Materials and you book. There we go. That is something I'll get to later. Mobs are going to spot in my house, I swear to god. Alrighty. So over here, there's a cave or two. And I, can I mine this? I forgot to get a shovel. I knew I was forgetting something. Shovel. Yeah, um, because it looks like gravel, that's actually requiring a shovel. So, bet you didn't know that, did you? Well, it should use a shovel. Maybe not. I think better shovels are a lot better. So this is tin, right? Yeah. The tin looks like copper. Don't ask. I, I have no clue why. But yeah. So this this is tin. And I'm sure we're going to come across something that looks exactly like this. And it's going to be copper. In fact, I'll be sure to point that out soon. <sighs> so after this, I'll have a tin. Which is actually a really good thing. So, I can go frolicking over here. And I believe there's a couple dozen caves. Like this. There's copper. Oh, wow. I can't even break this. I came here for stone, didn't I? Yes, I did. Hmm. So... How's everybody doing? Good. Alright, glad to hear that. I'm doing fine. Yeah. Alright, so after we get this, I can make a furnace and cook up anything I catch now. And I need to find some coal really quickly. Well, actually I can smelt up some of the wood into charcoal. I think I'll do that. Iron! Oh my god, yes. First thing to find. Yes, thank you. I need iron. You need a lot of iron when you're modding. Alright, so let's just make a crafting table. And a furnace. And a pick. After getting more sticks. I'm loving these 1.5. Dragging things. Best thing ever. Alrighty, so iron. It's not one piece. Cool. Yeah, hopefully... Oh, yes, coal. Awesome. This is this is beautiful. I am loving this world. If I haven't mentioned that enough. I will be doing world downloads. Well, I could do world downloads, but it's not exactly a public pack I'm using. Considering I made it myself. I'll probably distribute... Maybe a config pack or something. There's a way to do that with multi-MC. So, I don't know. Leave a comment if you want any world downloads. Um, well, I mean, I'm fine with zipping it up and putting it online to download, but... Your choice. I'm not the one that needs a world download. Or, I don't even want a world download. That would just clutter up my downloads folder. Yeah, it's interesting to go back through and look at your downloads folder. Because there's just so many things that you download and then just kind of leave there. And then it's interesting to always go back and you can see you're like wow I downloaded that it makes you kinda 
reminisce about everything you downloaded. Sometimes you come across things you didn't even know you had. Sometimes you come across things you don't want to know you had. Or things that you shouldn't have had. Awesome. Cave 1. Completely unaccomplished. I forgot about this. <sighs> Alrighty. Another one. So this is a server, so people can join me. I'm not completely opposed. Oh, man. Lots and lots of... What is this? Is this copper, too? That's another color of copper. Yeah, we've got a lot of ores here. In case people haven't noticed. Why is there light? That's kind of worrying. What? La, what? What? I'm at Y level 50, and there's a freaking lava lake. What's up with this? What? <laughs> oh, oh yes, I need this. This is a claw. We can make a claw tool, which is actually really cool. And I need it, I think. Ah, great. What, dear lord. Alrighty. So let's get some torches. Why not? Hmm. Alrighty. That's a skeleton up there. Alrighty. So, yeah, this is a pretty big cave. So I'm going to explore it a little bit and get some more ores. And I will come back. What is this? This is Tenor. So yeah, I will be back as soon as I find something interesting. Because we're getting close to the end of the episode. Yeah, we'll be back. Well, first creeper encountered. First creeper blown up. And we found another cave. And, oh, oh god. Is that three creepers? No, that's just one. Alright, cool. It's kind of hard to take mobs seriously when they got hats on. Just saying on iTunes. Yeah. And there's another creeper. I think the mob spawn is a little bit skewed on the server. Probably just because it's a server. Alrighty. Second creeper. Down. Oh my god. A skeleton. Are you kidding me? No. Alright. This is not exactly my favorite cave anymore. Yeah, I didn't get very far. I mean, oh, I am almost walking in the lava. That would have been the best season starter ever. Oh my god, what is with you? Alright, skeletons. No, bad skeletons. I lost my sword. So I'm going to need to go back. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Come on, go, go, go. Up, up, up. It's night time again? Oh, I have my crafting table on me. Great. Alright, well, it's night time. I'm gonna head back to the house. Your mad dash. And gonna go and sleep. Hopefully there's not, like, a bazillion mobs inside my house. Oops. Crap. Didn't need that anyway. Alright, so let's light up the house, and then I'm probably going to end the episode here. It's 30 minutes. I'm probably going to make the episodes a little bit shorter. Ah! Get out of here! <sighs> so yeah, um, future episodes will be a bit shorter, but this is the beginning episode, so I kind of want to make it a tad bit longer. Awesome. So, not a bad start. Like, we've already got quite a bit of ores. Like I said, caves, a bit of skewed, but it's a price to pray for- Oh, okay. Let's start dumping ores in here, and then we can come back next episode. I forgot inventory tweaks. God dang it. So, yeah, let's see uses for a claw. There's no uses for a claw. I will find out what a use for a claw is. And, oh, furnace. Duh. Um, do I have anything to cook? No, because I'm... Yeah. Wait, no. Raw lamb... Raw lamb chops! What mod dad's that? Six two eight five. So here's a tip to how find stuff. 
you just scroll through to where the other items are, so 6285. It's going to be somewhere in the 6285s. This is Darkcraft. That's the Forsmiths and the Claw and Lamb Chops. Awesome. Darkcraft is pretty cool. It's like brand new. So there's not a whole lot to complain about it because there's not a whole lot to it. So that's awesome. And there is a spider outside. Okay. I'm gonna be running away before the creeper finds me. Alright, cool. What is that? Is that the Enderman noise? Alrighty. If so, I'm gonna be going back to bed. <sighs> Alrighty. Jeez. Holy crap. Ah! No! Bad skeletons! I don't know. Where is the Enderman that was yelling at me earlier? Alright, so that's the end of episode one. Thank you for watching this far, if you did. And we will see you in the next episode. My house! My beautiful yard! Oh my gosh. Well, I know what I need to repair. So remember that extra bark I got? be repairing my house with it uh, if I get around to it so yeah there's a lot of skeletons Wow I am too good today all right guys we will see you in the next episode of Jared man's let's play I guess that's what I'll call it this is technically seasons two but I'm gonna call it just Jared man's let's play so we will see you in the next episode and I will talk to you later.